Hello and welcome to lesson 58 in the creation of our school management system using Microsoft Excel and Word VBA with the GeForce IT Service Academy. Please, if this is your first time watching this video on this channel, please make sure that you subscribe to the channel. Turn on this notification bell icon for all. Make sure that you share this video with your friends and family members to also benefit from us on this channel. In lesson 57, we dealt with how to insert the various formulas that can help us to fetch data from the student detail sheet onto the official admission receipt for printing. So in this lesson, we are going to try our system and see if it is working or not. We are going to try and see whether the system is working perfectly or not. We are going to do some other basic settings. Then finally, we assign formulas and macros to this particular print uh, button here so that we can be able to print out the admission receipt and as well as the fees payment receipt without facing any challenge so let's just get started without wasting much time so as i said earlier in lesson 57 we inserted the formulas that can help us to fetch data from the student detail sheet onto this official admission receipt so what we are going to do is we are going to enter the first admission number from the student detail sheet that is going to be one so let's enter that particular admission number then we search for that particular student and let's see if the details will appear here or not okay so one like this then you click on search good so we have all the details of that particular student here this is the default contact <laughs> that is my default contact we have the date of birth here I have the gender I have the class the name the admission number date of admission admission fee for kg1 is 100 ghana cities the guardian name the address and then finally the contact okay so let's search for another student that is going to be student number two so the student number two is amaji basic two so the tuition fee is 100 ghana cities tuition fee admission fee 100 ghana cities blah 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 it's not supposed to be so it must vary okay so let's search for student number 10 here so 10 like this let's say for that student good so we don't have any detail for that particular student so let's quickly go to the student detail sheet here and let's check something student details sheet and let's check something here okay so that missing fee must vary but let's quickly go to the guardian and then the contact let's check something there so let's change the telephone number there so you right click select everything here like this then you click so 0540620528 so that is the guardian telephone number so let's control s to save then we search for student number one from the admission receipt the official admission receipt and let's see what is going to pop up so student number one search good so please have seen that we have the contact here we have the contact here for student number one okay so let's go back to the student detail sheet again and let's check something the guardian name let's change the guardian name to again let's see if it will take effect on the official admission receipt so i do wisdom like this then John Kojo like this then Adam Joe like this so control S to save your work then let's go to the official admission receipt and let's see if these things will take effect or not so let's check for student number one again so the guardian here is wisdom i do okay so it means the system is working perfectly so let's search for student number two 
The guardian angel is John Kojo. Okay. Student number three. Yes, yeah, search for that student. Adam Joe. Okay, so it means the system is working perfectly without any challenge. So this is how you insert the formulas onto this particular official admission receipt. Then you'll be able to get all the details of the students from the student detail sheet. So we don't want this video to be long, so we would like to end it here and continue in lesson 59 so thank you very much for watching this video in lesson 59 we are going to insert the formulas the various macros that can help to activate the print button here to help us uh, print out our receipt the button that can help us to print out the official admission receipt for each student that's what we are going to do in lesson 59 so please make sure that you watch that particular lesson 59 make sure that you share the video with your friends and family members let them also subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification button for all so that when we upload the lesson 59 they can also come and learn how to insert the formulas that can help us to activate the print receipt button so till lesson 59 i say thank you very much for watching bye bye Thank you.